At this stage, our map is nearing completion. There are a few more aesthetic touches that can be added. In this video, we will add and edit contour line labels on our map. Having the transparent polygons with the hillshade is a nice detail, but we also want viewers of our map to understand the third dimension, which is elevation. Including labeled contour lines is the easiest way to accomplish this. Navigate to the contents pane and toggle on the SP contour 10 meter layer that we created early on. Expand the feature class layer and double click on the line symbol to open up the symbology pane for this layer. Here I will change the color of the contour lines to a gray so that they don't stand out as much as the black contacts and linear features. Alternatively, you can adjust the transparency of the contour lines here, the same way we did with the polygons. Then right click SP contour 10 meter in the contents pane and open up the labeling properties. Like in the previous video with the polygon labels, you will notice at the top of the pane tabs for symbol and position. Again, I highly recommend looking through all the different options and menus as they really allow you full control to customize your map exactly how you want it. So I did not show in this video, but if you click the placement drop down menu here, Arc Pro has a specific built in contour line placement. I highly recommend using that if you're making geologic maps. Here I will remove some duplicate labels within a fixed distance. I will also click on the symbol tab to reduce the font size of the contour labels. This helps make them less distracting on the map. Whenever making changes to labeling properties, be sure to hit the apply at the bottom. Play around with all the different menus and options in the labeling properties window pane. Customize them until you are happy with the final result. In the next video, I will show you how to save and export individual layer class files.